Hi there, my name is Dave Nelson and welcome to the channel that's all about Alexa, Amazon's virtual assistant. Whether it's new commands, tips or tricks, product reviews, or to help you fix problems, I'll cover it right here on this channel, so welcome. This time the video is all about communication, how Alexa can hear you and how you can better understand her. Plus I'll be touching on a few other volume issues as well. I'm sure you've heard that phrase at least once before, and here's how you can fix it. First, it might help to put you in her place. To do that, just say this. Maybe knowing what she heard can help you figure out what the communication problem is and how to fix it. You'll either have to speak louder, more clearly, or reposition your Alexa-enabled device to a better location. Make sure your Amazon Echo is positioned in an open space away from noisy household items like washers, dryers, dishwashers, TVs, or home theater systems. That way, it may hear you better. Remember, the more objects between you and your Echo device, like a wall, the harder it will be for her to hear you. You can also use voice training, a tool in your profile settings in the Alexa app. You'll read 25 phrases aloud in a typical voice from a typical distance, so Alexa can get a baseline understanding of your pronunciation and cadence. If you've had your Alexa-enabled device long enough, this may have also happened to you. Somebody in the room says a word that sounds like Alexa, or you're watching a TV show, movie, or a YouTuber who just happens to have a channel that's all about Alexa, and he mentions her name a lot, and your speaker activates. Say, Alexa, why did you do that? This feature gives you a little insight as to why Alexa performed a certain action. Press the mute button on top of your Amazon Echo device while you're watching TV. Just don't forget to unmute it once you're done. The easiest and most effective way from stopping this from happening is to change the wake word from the default, which is Alexa, to computer, Echo, or Amazon. To do this, go into your Alexa app, tap settings, and then device settings. Select the device that you want to change the wake word on and scroll down to wake word. Tap on it and select the word you'd like to use. And finally, you may have noticed when timers or alarms go off, the sound is much louder or maybe quieter than the playback volume of Alexa. That's because alarm and timer volume is controlled separately within the Alexa app. If you'd like to learn and read more, click on the link in the description section below. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Leave a question or comment, and so you don't miss a single one of my videos, make sure to subscribe to the channel and click that notification bell. I'm Dave Nelson. Thank you very much for watching. Alexa, fade to black.